All right, I've been looking forward to checking out Digital Press. What? All right, when you first walk in, you got the plushies, giant Pikachu, sun faded games. Well, can't, can't escape it, you know. And this cracks me up. Got ET cradling with love. That's actually, I, that's, I still stand today. That's a good game. I like that game. Wreck-It Ralph. Got to know how to play it. Oh, that is Wreck-It Ralph. Right on, man. All right. Glass Joe. Here we go. The games are cool. I just love the stuff up here. Got the Pokemon Wall Scroll. Oh, I got my favorite. PSVR, yeah. I know, I'll tell you how much they want for it. Uh, one of these days, I'm gonna pick them up. One ninety-nine. It's funny, I have a spare, but I can't really ship it. The old case of stuff. I'm looking for... I'm not looking for anything in particular, but I just love this stuff, like the Assassin's Creed mug. The... Yeah, just the other stuff that they just have laying around or up on, like the little signage. That stuff there. <laughs> Got games in the back. Got the old school here. Oh man. There you go. Oh, Mr. Deuce Castle, that was a fun one. Ice cold beer from Taito. I don't think they ever made a port for that for the uh, NES there. <laughs> Not sure how they would, I guess, but, you know. Yeah, I love those figures there. There's a couple of them at the, uh, the, um, the show, the uh, video game con that were there. They had the Punch-Out one. That was like, it's one of those. Murder inside. <laughs> oh, yep. That's a good deal on it, too. Only 20 bucks. A little Mario on the turtle. Oh, wow, yeah. See, I love that stuff, too. I like my Wii U. I, I really... I enjoyed it. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why nobody else did. <laughs> I liked mine just fine. I know they're all the best games are all coming out for you know Switch now anyway. But yeah, Piranha. He's a very nice. Not familiar with Piranha, but. <laughs> oh look! At, I thought it was a Gauntlet backpack for a second. I was like, I have all the backpacks you could license. Oh, boy. Yeah. oh, there we go. I'm in that. I'm in that a little bit. Good to see. Oh, that's right. The virtual. This is the. the ta there's two. Uh, two virtual boy kiosks. This is like the tabletop one. And there's a. Um, a, a full standing one too that just popped up at a store. Popped up at a store recently in um, near the Seattle area. Maybe it's. Uh, yeah, maybe it's. I don't know, Portland or something. The Dreamcast imports. Oh, yep. I don't have I don't have the red one, but I have the green one, and I have the one that looks like the uh, NES card that has the instruction manual for the uh, table of contents. All right, tell me the story behind this guy. What is this guy? What video game is that from? I don't want to know. Nothing I want to play. I'm filming them filming me. Oh, here's some cool books up here. I love that Art of Atari one, too. Oh, I just picked up Phoenix. Picked that up at the show. The Zack Son with the box. What? Oh, I don't have this one. I don't have the history of uh, video games and 64 objects. 30 bucks? I might, I might grab that before I head out of here. Oh, they have the overlays for the mattress. Oh, that's right, yeah. Yeah, you need those to uh, get your games some color. I don't have a Vectrex is one of those I've never had. I just recently played it for the first time. I thought it was amazing. I oh, love, I love the vector based uh, it's, graphics. It's very sharp. It's a lot more sharp than you think it'd be. Oh, there we go. Cabbage Patch Kids. All right. All right. There's some more stuff over here too, huh? No display over there. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Little stuffed animals. Got the Wii stuff. I always try to find if they have it. It's going to be for a ridiculous price, but maybe not ridiculous price. The Data East Arcade Classics. Oh yeah. I saw one at the show for like fifty bucks. I was like, that's a, actually probably a pretty good deal for it anymore. 
I just recently got the Metal Slug anthology. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. David yeah. loves playing Metal Slug. I love Metal Slug. <laughs> More trinkets. All the, the Atari cars. Yeah, those are always fun. Especially if you're like a, like a Hot Wheels collector. All right, this, this is actually, I like this. Oh, yeah, there's your Vectrix right there. My friend, uh, the one I was telling you about that has a lot of games, he just bought a uh, Channel F. Oh, wow, okay. And, yeah, the uh, Fairchild or whatever. Oh, there's, yeah, right there. He bought it at um, the Too Many Games. Oh. And I feel bad for him because he bought it in box, $200, and he got it home and it didn't work. Oh, no. <laughs> so now he's trying to figure out how to fix it. <laughs> oh, man. I felt so bad. I'm so excited. <laughs> My goodness. Oh, I used, to, I used to have that Scooby Doo maze game for the uh, in television. Found that a lot. He Man. He Man. Oh, dude, that's so good. Uh, Castlevania Ryan's a huge He Man fan, so. Yeah, he, he'd probably make him a deal on that. There's one time, I, I wasn't really familiar with it, but I saw the uh, Fairchild Channel F. Um, like, so many. I mean, because they're all numbered, too. So there's like two rows full of games at like Salvation Army. I don't know what they were going for, but I was like, I didn't even think about it. I didn't even buy them. They're so cool. Look, do you ever see the uh, joysticks? They're like the circular, like it look, almost looks like a Wii mode, but it has a button at the top. Oh, I don't know. May, I'm, I may have. They're so cool oh, looking. There we go. I, I don't like Gotta have that. That's that's from my generation. <laughs> the old switch there. Oh, here we go. It's all right. A lot of box card games. This is not a library. <laughs> what about that? Please read after you buy it. It's an okay All right. All right, fine. Stuff. Oh, good lord, there more stuff. Go. Yeah. That's a good start. yeah, this place is packed. This place has all kinds of stuff here, right? I, I, I played Fusion. It's that it got so interesting to, uh, it's interesting to go through. The, I'm like, like, come on, it's Samus wearing a Fusion suit. Got to beef up the GameCube collection. Oh, wow. Do they have... Yokai Watch, aka the... Uh, oh, Curious George, uh, all right. Oh, yeah, I saw oh, Def Jam uh, Vendetta. That's a good game. Yeah, I did. I, I, I bought it at the show. I grabbed one. I have it for PlayStation 2, but I grabbed it for the GameCube now. Smash. Oh, this is Smash Brothers. Nice. I heard this is pretty good. Oh, yeah, 13. yeah, 13. I wonder if they have a GameCube version of Beyond Good and Evil. Probably not. I wouldn't be surprised if they did. No, they don't. Oh, they have freaky flyers. I was actually looking for. Oh yeah, I grabbed one of those at the uh, Seattle Expo oh, last time around. Yeah, that's about the, about, the, about the price I paid for it too. I think I might pick this up. All right, <laughs> while you're here, may as well. A little souvenir for the road. Oh, Donkey Kong. <laughs> Donkey Kong returns. You know, so I bought the other Donkey Kong game at the show, but I don't have Donkey Konga yet. Oh, I just recently got that one. I, so. I, I've been collecting the um, GameCube games lately. Yeah, oh, no, me too. <laughs> Trying to get the good ones. <laughs> the first, especially the most iconic ones? Yeah, yeah, the first party ones. Before they go uh, higher up. <laughs> like, Ooh. Uh, like Watch the step. Ride. Yeah, yeah, that's a good game. Smash Brothers Melee? That's actually the number one game to, to find. So this... Yeah, I don't have it, but... Well, I found some CDI stuff. Watch out now. Oh, we've got an import here. Look at this. Got sticky bear math. I used to be the best at it. I'm still at it. Treasure of the Smithsonian. I think I have that one. Name that tune. Now that would be hilarious. Five bucks? I might grab this. All right. Mystic Midway. I just picked up Mystic Midway. Oh, it's a cheaper price here than what I paid for it, too. Darn it. <laughs> Man. So cool. Casey Munchkin. The classic. Great story behind that, too. Look up the story if you don't know. I went to court. Went to court over it. Oh, what's this one? What's this one? Human Sports Festival. Dude, this is so cool. Yeah, I, I there's an episode where they're at the store, right? Yeah, I think what was it? 
I forgot what the prank was. I think it was uh, to make my characters mildly uncomfortable, like people mildly yeah. uncomfortable. Uh, they either had to sell them on, or they had to like make them. What was it? I want to say that they had to make them agree that a, a, a made-up game existed. They're like, oh, have uh, you ever played this game? And there uh, the basement. Let's check it out. I'm only a couple months in at this job, but I have a let's see, fairly decent knowledge. Okay. So here's the basement where we keep our overstock or things that we've held hold out for eBay, things like that. All right. If you go through here, we actually have like a bunch of the systems organized. Oh, nice. A whole graveyard of Xbox One, things like that. Wow. <laughs> like we kind of, we have them organized kind of from newest to oldest. So as you go down, we actually go from PlayStation 4 to PlayStation 3 to PlayStation 2. All oh, the way fun. back to like even Pong, like old Pong machines. Yeah, yeah. It's a, uh, oh, here it's we go. Cool. Got the old, uh, let's see the switches here, but let's, let's see. <laughs> so, yeah. Keeps on going and going. Candy Vision one. Oh, there we go. Super Video Arcade and Legal Vision. All this nice stuff. Wow. Wow, that's amazing. Crazy. Yeah. If you look, if you like, look towards your left. I know we pass over. Where's the Wii? No, yeah. Cubes from Sega Saturn as well. And some other box stuff as well. Sure. Right here we keep like arcade stuff, light guns, and miscellaneous like different wires and things like that. We try to pair together with everything. So. Crazy. This is stuff that we keep aside just in case if we ever need to pull some up. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Couple more boxes, the Ace Combats, Sega Genesis, Atari Flashbacks. Alright. And then oh, over sorry. here. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> okay. So over here it's just like um like more of like the extra like games that we have for various consoles. Sometimes we have like a crap ton of like Mario Paints or Oh sure. Hey you Pikachu's and we try to pair <laughs> up pair up like uh, the microphones and the mouses yeah. with that. We actually have some uh, some screens in here. Uh, this one actually took me by surprise. Uh, this Ooh. is one of the dev models for the GameCube. What? Look at that color. Yeah. That's like, a, that that's like a dark teal or something, man. Yeah, that's crazy. I love the color. I wish it worked with retail games. I'm not sure. Wow. But, yeah. Wow. This is an NR reader. Yeah. So it's pretty nice to look at. This one I just saw on Chance. Pretty yeah. Cool. It's pretty neat stuff here. Awesome. Do you go over and go through the Mario paints and load them up to see if anybody saved their uh, masterful uh, works of art? <laughs> Not yet, but now I know. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Gotta do that sometime. Yeah, yeah, little, for sure. A little angry video game there, Cameo. How about that? <laughs> That's right. Um, That's funny. Here. Put his name right on that. Mm -hmm. Silver Marker. We go through here. This is where a good chunk of our, like, uh, older like just a good chunk of our overstocks for like a uh, game boy game boy advance game gear sure. all that nice stuff, some and sealed even, stuff. Like, where we keep some of our imports so, so we got some oh import, yeah some import what? game gear stuff and some super famicom Yo. import famicom stuff wow. super famicom oh, yeah wow. got the famicom uh, yeah we have we had a festival north star famicom game and oh nice got the engage yeah and the shonen jump crossover and the engage you know you know we're we're in uh, low demand for those. But. Got the oh, but I don't know. You got the uh, you're selling them for a penny. Come on penny? now, <laughs> aftershock for a penny. WWE. Ah, dude, why are they doing down here? Should be up there. I would have bought one. <laughs> I'd buy it for a penny. I don't know. Maybe maybe. Poyo pop. And we got. No, he didn't engage first, I guess. Or... We don't get too many imports, unfortunately. But like yes. when we do, we kind of like keep them down here because they don't really sell and people don't really have much access to the import. So I got sunshine. I actually don't know what this is. You know, I do have a no, Japanese a... GameCube. Yeah. So if you're interested, I, I'm not sure if he's saving these for anything, but I asked my boss if I could sell these off. So I got One Piece, Career and Squash. Oh, I heard good things about this one. It's relatively interesting. Oh, yeah. What? It's like spinning around. Yeah. Like a Dude, that's thing awesome. With a bird. And it looks like Game Boy Link cable connectivity. Yeah. And we keep going down. Here's like where our, like, our, our actual video game graveyard. So these are like consoles that have been like damage and things and then we kind of like source all the parts and oh, I see. new again sure it's needs, nice. needs a reshell reshells <laughs> all that nice stuff yeah um, so oh, got some stuff. I wish Metal Jesus is here got the Link stuff he's collecting for Links right now so <laughs> oh wow um yeah I think some import Sega Saturn oh, stuff too oh yeah dude Super Robot Wars oof yeah that's my favorite one this is, this is the fun this is where all the gold is down here I'm telling you oh hey we even got the import of Shenmue 2 oh nice yeah it's nice oh, nice love... cover art of that mm -hmm. dude okay yeah and well ColecoVision Ataris and stuff like yeah. that but bins and bins yeah. and bins full of these it's, see that it's oh. impressive and like, we recently sold our like some of our stock to Leo to the new store okay so like even though even though we offloaded uh, I missed the little switch if you could put oh. that for me right here oh right sure yep yep go for it. 
Nothing. Nothing. Even though we offloaded a good chunk of our overstock, we still have a lot left over. I see that. Oh, that's right. You guys just opened another store, right? Yeah. Yep. And here's where we get into more modern stuff. So sure. you got the Donkey Konga bongos. I noticed you bought. I bought Donkey. <laughs> yeah, I just I just bought the bongos at the uh, at the uh, a video game con. So nice. I gotta have the Donkey Konga to go with you gotta it. Go, you gotta go. You gotta go. Slap and clap. I'm telling you. Yeah, totally. My kids are gonna love it. Yeah. So now we got like I guess this is in the other side of it, but there's a bunch of PlayStation One stuff too. Wow. A bunch of modern things. We even got Nintendo Monopoly. Yep. <laughs> That's the, that's our prize procession here. That's why we have the store open. <laughs> that's that's exactly. That's why it's under lock and key and all yeah. that. You know, it's all and, about that Nintendo Monopoly. And then here's where it more or less ends. I mean, there's okay. To it, you want to like explore any specific? We got like a resurfacing station. Yeah. No. This is. I just wanted to just a quick peek around the the block here and mm -hmm. see what all is here. It's cool to see like you know the the, the uh, FZ one in a box and got the Jaguar of course. And... I think these yes. Oh, those these are great. boxes are actually empty. These are the ones that we use to just like. Fill in like if we were only like, filling spaces, just to make a complete picture with inside okay. the spaces. <laughs> so while we do have some like complete and bought stuff, which we usually put out unless it's like sealed, which we actually right. sometimes do. Dude, um, oh, just won't hear too much. So bear with me. So, there. Sega Saturn. Wait a minute. I'm gonna do a little peeksy. Hey, go for it. What? Ah, the fruit. You're holding out on me, buddy. I'm telling you. Uh, these are going on eBay. So okay, these are the eBay stuff? <laughs> All right, so here's, here's, here's the eBay stock. So, All right, hands off the merchandise. Hands off. Well, not necessarily. You yeah. can peek and look. All and right. These are just more of the empty boxes cool. that we do for it. Okay. Um, yeah, these are all empty. I think these are just more, okay. more of the overstock and eBay stuff here. All right. But there might be some little, little nice Easter eggs. Yeah, just posters and other memorabilia. There's a Crackdown 2, Standy, Grand Theft Auto Chinatown. Standy. Bought a lot of neat stuff down here. Nice. Alright, how fast can you run? I'm gonna grab a handful of stuff and book it, man, out of the front door. <laughs> uh, well, I'm a decent runner. <laughs> okay, then I'm probably out of luck then. Uh oh. Is it's this the treasure chest? <laughs> here's the Ark of the Covenant here. What do we got? What do we got? A whole lot of all right. That's a nice little box, though. Little All right. Me off. It had the buckles, but it really just clipped on. Yeah. It made me look a fool. It's all right. All right. Well, you got yeah. This is all kinds of, and this is all eBay stuff here too, right? Actually, no. This is just overstock that we kind of just put okay. out. So like, just general like. Pros. Well, not places to move, but wires, adapters, things like that. Yeah. Some figurines. We even have a couple of Nandoroids over here, Oh, too. yeah, I see those. They're Mario, right Mega Man, and a Figma. Sure. Some other stuff that, like, not necessarily video games, but video game related. Right. That we could put out, and if we ever, like, need to fill some space, here's where we keep all the manuals. Well, these are the NESs yeah. that we have to, like, repin and things like that, so when they're ready to go, we place them yeah. here. Um, Which John is this? They're from uh, 05. John from 05. Yeah, Joe, all my support. Best wishes with you. Oh, maybe he's a uh, maybe he's the programmer for that game or something. I don't know. Mm, that happens the slightest. I don't know. If you let me, if you know what it is, let me know in the comments. Well, definitely. <laughs> Someone's got to know. Someone's got to know. Oh. It ain't me, and it ain't John Hancock, as far as I know. So. And down here is just where we keep like our stuff where we hold for like our events. <laughs> so like every month we have an album oh. where like it's a different oh. theme every month. Like Culture last Museum. month was uh, Genesis Does on Nintendo. Yeah, right. So we had like a Road Rash tournament, we had a Sega Sonic uh, like a high score tournament too, and everybody was playing Genesis and having a good time. So this is where we keep like TVs, our CRTs, our, we even have a Vectrex right here. We had the previous... Oh, Vectrex. I heard previous, Vectrex. Oh yeah, there we go. Yep. Yeah, the previous uh, novel was like a Vectors based one, so we had a whole line of Vectrexes. Oh, so nice. Here. Just playing, and I think somebody brought some homebrew stuff for Vectrex too, yeah. so it's, right. getting a, sure. it's getting a nice little community. Wow. Okay, it I'm is. Really yeah. For it. yeah, Yeah. Yeah, Vectrex fans are, are out it's there. It's very but, nice. I remember yeah, really, uh, seeing a YouTube video like comparing a PS4 and Xbox One to a Vectrex, and this one has superior video technology. <laughs> right, I'm telling you. Say. <laughs> and this is where we keep our boxes, just for like to pack our system packages, such like this. And like over here are the orphans, unfortunately, like Aww. cases without discs or discs without cases. The orphans. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's funny. And just a bunch of miscellaneous repair stuff, some arcade, like. Some oh, that's a fancy uh, that's advantage there. Plug into the TV. Keyboards. I think these are the Miracle keyboards. Oh, the Miracle piano. Yeah, yeah for yeah. the NESs. 
I think they did a couple different versions for different systems as well. I think anyway. the these are the these are manuals in here. Uh, I think those might be the actual systems. It's like it because oh I here's, here's here's a here's a box of manuals in this one. Let's oh see. wow, look at that. Here, look at look at the uh, the NES one. Sure. Just out of curiosity here. Because they actually do end up getting a lot. Wow, this box is heavier than I expected. Well, it's, it's full of paper. Yeah, it's full of paper. Dead trees. Wow. Oh, dude, look at all those manuals. The map. <laughs> oh, the maps. What, dude? Oh, that's so awesome. All right, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Give me a heart attack. Oh. Now you got to deal about. <laughs> now you got to worry about putting it back somehow. Sorry about that. Yeah, don't even worry about it. All right. There you go. Oh, there you go. <laughs> like a pizza box. There we go. Right. It's, never, right. it's never gonna close. Yeah, not uh, properly. I'll fix it later. There we go. Nope, not the other there side popped go. up. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Okay, it sounds good. Well wow. Oh, wow, paper's heavy. A lot of, a lot of <laughs> That's the lesson we could take away from today. Okay, yeah. And then I guess we paper shouldn't weigh as much as it does. Some promotional stuff too. Okay. Like a Wolfenstein blimp. Oh, <laughs> That's wow. actually pretty comical that it's Wolfenstein, you know, Germany and all that. With the... <laughs> the Topical. <laughs> now, it looks That's like some Mario costumes, some t-shirts that I guess we've accumulated over the years. Um, I think this was generally That's just it. pretty much it, huh? This is awesome. Well, thank you very much for yeah, showing us around, you. dude. No problem, no problem. Yeah, this is awesome. This is great. cool stuff. I know it. All right, I'm going to head back this way and check out the, the ball blazer on the way out. And... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it could be one of each, huh? Yeah. The, the the pile of guitars is what my goodwill looks like. <laughs> it's all guitars and Wii Fit pads, I'm telling you. Fun thing, I think they're coming back because we're getting more and more people asking about them. Oh, well, there you go. Yeah. You know, that that Guitar Hero nostalgia. Yeah, totally. Mario walkie talkies. <laughs> oh yeah, this is from a recent trade-in, so like we got like wow. a oh, there's some uh, marquees Mario, up here. Like memorabilia, so like a Mario radio, Mario walkie-talkie. Oh, that great. Some Super Mario movie promotional gear. What? Has like a little cassette. Oh, that's cool. Wow. Yeah. All right. Like, so well, this is Digital Press. Um, if you can't make it downstairs, here's a quick tour. But please stop by, grab some deals, grab some games. And big thanks to the owners of Digital Press for letting me uh, letting us hang out down here. Sweet, thank you very much.